precious finds and fashions spanning the decades can be found here in Nashua. Well, uh, I am a girl that loves glitter, and it was here in the shop, and I decided it must be mine. Good chance you're not going to find another piece like it. Regina Lang is the owner of Snap It's Vintage, a shop that this former waitress worked towards for 30 years. All your tips, all your extra money was going to <laughs> buy what? <laughs> Clothing, furniture. She filled three storage units with antiques of all kinds. So all that time buying things that... Someday I was going to have a store. Someday I was going to have a place to put it. So. Everybody else thought it was crazy. You're like, it's never going to happen. She had always had a dream of having an antique shop, but nobody had ever believed in it or believed in her. No one until she met her husband, Ed. When I met him, I was waitressing, and uh, I turned around and you sit at the counter, and I had a coffee pot in my hand, and I went, coffee? <laughs> it was so cute. It was my dream to make her dream come true. So Ed found this spot on Main Street in the Gate City and transformed it. He even shellacked a special poem onto the floor. If it hails or snows, keep it going. When it looks like it's all up, keep it going. It's my wife. No matter what, she just keeps it going. How can you not fall in love? You know what I'm saying? This is, this is what captured me in the beginning. Regina's love of vintage started with hats. You frame your face. You look beautiful. <laughs> and the color is perfect. She's also drawn to Victorian clothing. Everything had lace or a bow or something frilly and feminine about it. And this is just the pocket inside. And of course, this is the old version. Imagine when it was new and she put it on, you know. She must have felt fabulous. Downstairs, housewares will definitely bring you back. My personal favorite area of the store is like our back lounge room where we've got all of the mid-century furniture and the lighting and it's ambient. I love it down there. I could spend all day down there. Movie companies have found a treasure trove of period costumes here at Snap. Anne Hathaway's hat and the witches came from this shop. The biggest one that I've done now is Julia on HBO. HGTV host and designer David Bromstad has also shopped here. He strolled in and fell in love with my store, and then he came back again. Many walk in as customers and end up becoming dear friends. Some end up getting hired. Most of my paycheck goes towards me buying clothes here, and I don't feel guilty about it at all. <laughs> I have learned so much from Regina and Ed about this business, and I love it here. What do you call this one? What is this called? Well, some people call it a stick phone, some people call it a lollipop, according to the era, really. It was both around the same time. So you were talking to here. Hello? <laughs> Operator? <laughs> As pickers, they've made some amazing finds. And I saw just the front of the tire sticking out of the ground, and I'm like, what is that? And I grabbed hold of it, and I pulled, and it didn't want to come, and I pulled a little harder, and the next thing I know, out comes rolling this set of forks to an authentic chopper of the era. And right there was the seat, the Triumph original seat for it. I love history, and that's why I'm in the game. I love the stories behind all the pieces. I can't believe you're selling it. Listen, someone else needs to love it now. They work with more than 100 consigners and upcyclers. And if there's only one earring, it'll end up being a hairpin. And if it's a broken necklace, it'll end up being a bookmark. So everything gets a life and it keeps going, which is fun. History worth keeping. Snap It's Vintage is a special shop where time is cherished and treasured pieces are finding new life. To see my wife up there glowing like the sun, there is nothing better than that. To actually fulfill your dream and to, in the end, feel better than you expected it to, that's pretty powerful. <laughs>